What's up guys, I asked Bright back with another player on the channel. I am full of cold, but the grind continues. We have just hit 1,000 subs on YouTube. I didn't think I'd ever get to it. I thought I'd just do this just for some fun. But no, we hit 1,000 subs, so all support, very much grateful. But let the grind continue. Today, it is Cobber Libertadores squad foundations player. I think most people know him, Roque Santa Cruz. The ex-Blackburn Man City striker. He's now playing his trade back in it's Argentina. And he looks incredible, let's be honest. 88 rated striker, obviously Paraguayan. Six foot three, high medium work rates, right footed, four star school moves, not five star weak foot. And he's a first owner because all you gotta do is four, well, five objectives. Shown on screen. Pretty simple, not too difficult to do. It literally took me, I think, about seven games. Um, so pretty straightforward and to be honest this car looks fantastic so i probably would recommend doing it he can play striker or center forward attributes wise 95 acceleration and 96 sprint speed so he's fast shoot look at this look at these shooting stats 98 attack, attacking positioning 96 finishing 93 shot power 95 volleys and 92 penalties he could finish lethal passing wise not the best vision crossing free kicks ain't great but 89 short passing 80 long passing and 90 curve is pretty decent. Dribbling neck for a six foot three tall striker, 85 agility and 84 balance is pretty good. 85 reactions, 95 ball control with 83 dribbling and 96 composure. So if he gets in the right positions, he will bag some goals. Defending is pretty poor, apart from 99 heading accuracy with 80 jumping at six foot three. This car is going to be lethal from corners, from crosses with that 97 strength, 83 stamina, and 83 aggression. For a tall, strong striker, it's probably the best stats I've seen on the game. He's got injury prone and power header. My only downfall with him really is linking him. So that's why this team is a little bit mixed. Um, obviously I've put icons, heroes in there because they automatically get three chemistry. And I've added some less kind of player, Cobber, Cobber Libertadores players in there just to give him a try and well, yeah, we'll see how he goes. But I'm looking forward to this. I think he could be fantastic. So review will be at the end, clips will follow, enjoy. So, Libertadores squad foundations player, Roque Santa Cruz, is actually incredible. Probably one of my favourite strong, tall strikers on the game. Three games, five, three games, five goals. Obviously, that five-star week is incredible. He is very, very fast. He reminds me of a better Haaland. Like, Haaland, I loved using. 
but I'd actually say this guy in game feels a lot better. He's fast. He can definitely finish. Honestly, at 96 finishing, he's so fun to use. He feels so agile for someone who's six foot three. Um, he wins headers. He, his heading actually is fantastic. He doesn't score everyone, but it makes the keeper save. And he did score two very important headers for me, um, which made me win the game. He's also very strong. He can outstrength most players. Um, and definitely finish. Great shot power, volleys. Everything about him is the perfect striker. Obviously, he's got the power header trait, which is great for defending corners as well as attacking corners. But for an out and out tall striker, you have to do this card. He is fantastic for free as well. Realistically, it will take you five games if you win every game. Um, it took me six or seven, which isn't that much for how good this card is. And if you don't want to use him, it's fodder. So you can use him with other SBCs. But for me, he is a super sub, especially a weekend league. Last. I don't know, 30 minutes, 20 minutes, corners coming in, headers, pace, strength, he is what you want. So, yeah, get him. Fantastic. So please leave a like, subscribe, and Team of the Week comes out today, so there'll be some reviews, to, well, later this evening. So, yeah, thanks.